A few dozen people in Red Lake are spreading positivity by ho hopping on a motorcycle to share an important message. Our own Sheryl Moore brings us into the annual Red Lake Suicide Prevention Ride for this week's Community Spotlight. Suicide has always been a hard subject for most to talk about. Instead of avoiding the conversation, Red Lake has put their energy into bringing awareness to prevention. We've been doing this for 11 years, like today's 11th year, and we try and help out uh, people that have a crisis with suicide attempts or any, any suicide issues that come out. We, we try and help them with like uh, hotel rooms or gas money to go where they need to go. The Red Lake Ride Against Youth Suicide Prevention is 142 miles long with five stops down Highway 89 and 32. Right after the motorcycles take off, a parade also starts in Red Lake. Many of the founders started it because of a tragedy that was all too common in the community. At the time, um, there were a number of people who kind of joined together, a bunch of women. Um, they have long lost kids in, in their family. So then what we decided to do was to take and start a, a motorcycle ride because a couple of members had motorcycles, and they said, let's do a motorcycle ride. Over the years, the ride's message has grown. This year, there are more than 60 bikes that are part of the suicide prevention ride. This is here is, is probably one that's really, really big. Um, we usually run probably about um, 40, 45 bikes. They're not only Red Lake bikes. No, there's bikes. Um, the, mo the majority of the bikes come from other areas. The Mitchell, Blackduck, Clearbrook. Well, I got a four road. At the end of the ride, the bikers have a walleye dinner feast and a spiritual ceremony. This is where everyone is reminded of the meaning behind the prevention ride. We run a positive, positive program. You know, we want to just be positive and kind and show love and understanding to all the people that show up. And that's what we promote is love, kindness and understanding. Reporting in Red Lake with this week's Community Spotlight, Shrell Moore, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.